And I told her that I do not care for matters of Anglo-Saxon not, if he be a hero. Hi there, my name is Lindsay Lavin, and I'm the musical director of Toilers of the Sea, The Life of Joshua James, which we're premiering later this month at both the New River Estuary Center and at our former Beer Amphitheater. I'm very pleased to have with me two of the actors in our cast, with David Clapp, who's portraying Joshua James, and Michael Barnett, who is going to be portraying John Boyle O'Reilly, whose home is the Hall Library. And uh, this is a very exciting production. It's based on uh, the town's two historical, famous historical figures, uh, especially Joshua James and John Boyle O'Reilly. Uh, our production last year was uh, based on the Blue River Estuary here, and it was yeah. on this river. And we were very, very pleased and honored that it went on to receive a Massachusetts Cultural Council Gold Star Award, outstanding contribution to Massachusetts arts and culture. And I uh, we'll think this show will be very, very well attended. We're inviting everybody in the community and surrounding towns to come and see it. It should be a very exciting production with a fabulous cast, lots of good singing, and it should be a really wonderful show. Not just somebody who just, you know, woke up one day and said, I'm going to start writing songs. You've actually, you know, studied this very much. Can I just have you touch on your background a little bit? Sure. Uh, I studied a lot of private instruments. Uh, I first studied instruments privately when I was growing up. Piano, um, violin, guitar, all that good stuff. And uh, when I went to college, I majored in English and minor in theater. I did my graduate work in theater, specialized in playwriting. And uh, then over the years, I've been writing songs and recently decided to put the theater and music all together. I've also worked as a professional singer and actress, so I can approach it from, from those um, aspects as well to really try to make it um, a show that's easy to perform uh, from the actors and singers' points of view. My name is David Clapp. I'm a um, resident of Hall. I've lived here for 30 years. Had my schooling at Boston University, at Boston Conservatory, excuse me, that was uh, quite a few years ago. And um, I uh, really haven't done anything on stage formally for quite a few years. This is, like I mentioned, this is my uh, getting back into it, which is a nice outlet. It's a nice outlet for, for me, and uh, I hope the entire audience, uh, audience enjoys it. Thank my name is Mike Warwick. I live in Hingham. Um, over the last year, I had the opportunity to explore something that I've wanted to forever, which is singing and many other things associated with it because I retired from a daytime job. So I now have the time to do that. And uh, I was fortunate, I was in the Higgins Cabaret, and Cindy saw me uh, singing a, a hokey song, uh, and, and acting ham-like, and said, well, this guy could be pretty good, I think. That's what she was thinking. And she invited me to try out for part of this play. And I'm glad she did, because this part of John Will O'Reilly is fascinating. And it's, it's a great challenge, and it's a lot of fun. Hi, can I ask your name? Uh, my name is Spencer Love, I live in Hingham. Okay. And uh, I haven't really, I've never really sang in public before. Uh, I started I started singing to myself a couple months ago, and my mom thought I sounded really good. And she suggested that I audition for this, and she's known to do for a couple of years. She does a choir with her. I, I haven't done acting much either, but sometimes I make like quick scenes in front of friends and family. Uh, they think I'm right. I just, you know, decided that I should try out for it anyways because it seems like a good thing to do. I've never actually been in a real play or a musical. That's great. Now, how old are you? Uh, I'm 11, I'm turning 12 in September. So, this is sort of your first time really doing something pro professional? That's great. Do you think that maybe you're going to take it a step beyond that and maybe try out for all the pots and stuff coming out in Boston with movies and what have you? Uh, I don't know. Uh, I think that, uh, as soon as we're done with the, uh, done the musical and everything, I'm going to start thinking about if I liked it or not. And then see if I could try and uh, see if I can, if I wanted to do like an acting camp or something. Or yes, hi. I'm Sandy Baker and I'm from Marshfield. And this is my first time performing with the Hull Performing Arts. Um, I know Cindy through our choir at church, and I came down to try out for a little part. And um, I am now um, Esther Dill James, who is Joshua James's mother, and I play a 40-year-old woman, so that's pretty exciting. So um, my background, as far as any kind of theater things, I've also been involved with the Ham Cabaret for 25 years, and done singing and dancing, and I've also um, in the past have 
performed with Hingham Civic Music Theatre from Hingham himself. I'm looking very forward to this production. I've learned a lot about the history of Joshua James and things in Hull. And uh, it's a great cast of people to be working with. And I think it will be a wonderful show. And I hope as many people as can come, do come. Are you from Hull? Yeah, I'm from Hull. Oh, great. Okay. So now you're playing the young Joshua James. Mm -hmm. That's great. Now you've been in plays before here though, right? Yes. Now this is a big role. I mean, you're playing the lead character here. Yes. Now let me ask a little bit about you. Um, now, is acting something you want to pursue or is it something you're just doing while you're young? Or? Well, I guess I'll do it while I'm young. I'll see where my career takes me. How are you thinking about now with all the movies and stuff being filmed in Boston? Are you thinking of trying out for any of those roles? Maybe. Why not? Why not? Well, nice to meet you. Good luck. Thank you.